Today's message is very interesting. And some, you, you, some people feel uh, I, this, this, this word is some weird. So uh, you may chill. Huh? So some say chill, feel cheer. Yeah, I understand. It's very, very interesting. I'm going to give to you this message that uh, uh, concerning of the today's uh, the rapid advanced technology that we are using now in everyday life. Every day living in our life we are touching, we are handling, we are doing this device, technology. Uh, yeah, it, this technology give us very convenient our life we never expected before. It gives us uh, very, very rapid communication to each other in this global. The rapid advance of technology is transforming civilization in ways. Yeah, yeah that is absolutely right. I'm telling you. Hmm? Look at the technology we are using now in your life. Eh? The many, many ways you are doing. Uh, yeah. No one expected before. Previous genera generation never expected this technology I using in everyday our life of a human being in many, many ways that are very exciting, yeah. Uh, some people are addicted in, especially young generation, a lot of young generation are addicted to this technology, like uh, internet, smartphone, and the game machine, and extra. And sometimes we f I feel scary. Hmm? Yeah. This way we are doing by this technology, we are just only beginning. Just the beginning, I would say, the, just, just, just starting to understand this modern technology seems on the verge of recreating human being into new world, new things. We are going to, to open the new world. We never saw of the before. Uh, something, yes, the deal. Uh, something altered going to big change the civilization. Something bionic, bionic, something computerized. Hmm? The computer world we are living now. Every, everything, computer are, computer is doing. Government, the companies, the, in the personal affair, all we are doing 
operating by computer, computer network, satellite, and the universe. Yeah. This all modern technology are doing over the all our living things we are doing everyday life. Mm. Something robotic. Robot is doing everything. Some this this device is going to make superhuman. Superman is not, I'm not talking about the movie. That's a real, it is a reality we are living in this world. Internet uh, spider web network, internet, that is uh, control all over the world by government, the company. Spider web has uh, descended, descended, and covered uh, the, the early, the early all elements of civilization, civilization of a human being in history. Smartphone, smart watch, and smart home uh, are growing and growing rapidly, quickly, every day. I, I, I believe that. Not every month, every day. Into the smart world where we are living now. To the last days, to the last days, that Antichrist will go to rule all this world. I want to tell you this story, this message right now. You don't want to miss what I'm saying. Stay with me. Let's think about together this modern technology I'm speaking to you. Modern technology. Ah, uh, uh, all right. Let's consider deeply in a moment. This gives us hope, sometimes, hope that, ah, this is so wonderful, this machine. This device I'm using now is also, yeah, this unbelievable. You may thought. And sometimes some people fears in mind. Why? Why? Because oh end of time that Bible foretold in already in this this internet this modern technology in the book of the Bible long long time ago so the the, the my fear that last day is coming. That's why some Christians may feel, yeah, I, I feel fear too sometimes. Whenever I see this passage in the Bible, pros and the cons, prostitution, prosecution, not prostitution, sorry, prosecution, you know what I'm saying, prosecution, that going to handle by this machine, internet, computer. 
and the constitution. Hmm? And uh, some people, joy. <laughs> That's so good. This machine I'm using is very, very convenient. I never seen before. That's a wonderful device uh, I am doing now. The joy, joy, and wonder. They may wonder. See, those all things you may feel emotionally. Listen, my brother, sister. Had you read some to wonder? Finally, I feel wonder. Oh, I never expect this motion I'm going to do. I never ever expected before about the 20 or so, 30 or so. I never seen. 19, it's eight, yeah, 70, 60, yeah. There was no computer, a personal computer. No smartphone, you know. On president to the digital world, digital motion, was foretold in Bible prophecy. You may wonder, you may feel awesome, you may sometimes chill in your feeling, in your mind. Yeah. I, I'm doing now. Uh, some people say, recall uh, Daniel prophecy. Daniel said, uh, chapter 12, chapter 4, uh, about the end of time. Many shall learn to end the flow. And, and knowledge shall increase. Knowledge shall increase. This prophecy, listen, my friend, this prophecy Daniel prophesied a long, long time ago. 2,500 so. Has not been fulfilled until, uh, you know, recent history have we seen a time, a time when, when a lot of millions of people rapidly fly by airplane to go their destination and reach the, their destination uh, in short hours that previous generation, previous centuries, yeah, about to, to 19, I believe 40, 50, about 70 years ago, not a long time ago. The previous, the previous generation, they are, their transportation, they are using in, 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 in months, they are, they took months or sometimes even years. This prophecy, Daniel said, has not been fulfilled. Let me tell you, the journal website noted, listen, very interesting report. <coughs> this staggering trend, I'm telling you, you're thinking now. 
until year 1900, human knowledge, human knowledge approximately doubled every century, 100 years. However, by 1950, just 50 years later, by 1950, human knowledge doubled every 25 years. Just 25 years. Listen. In 2000, about 19 years ago, by 2000, human knowledge is almost doubling every day. I said every day. Are you listening, my friend? Every day. Yeah, that is true, sir. If I wake up in the morning, watch the TV in the morning, I, I used to surprise when I see the new device, the new car, new uh, the concept cut that, that the company ha has made that uh, another concept developed. I surprised. Hmm? In, in many, many things what we are seeing now, it, 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 technology are developing quickly every day that I'm talking to you now. Hmm? This should uh, certainly make uh, us pay attention to how quickly our world is changing. We are see by our eyes every day. Mm. This world has been changing day by day because modern technology contribute our life and the those internet everything is leading to our life and the history of human being that never is before age. Previous generation never expected, never saw about. Only Bible, even scientists and, and any the great man did not mention that in the future modern technology will rule the all of a human being in history. Nobody's predict. But only Bible. Bible says, Bible prophesied. God told us through the prophet. Human technology going to rule. And are using by the superpower which is Antichrist, that I'm going to tell you now. Hmm? Okay, firstly, <coughs> let's look at the how three specific Bible, Bible verses foreshadow, <coughs> foreshadow today's intercontinental internet, a smartphone, the big database, Year and how prophecy is being or might be fulfilled. That I want to tell you right now. That is just very interesting. In my story, for Jesus Christ, I uh, said uh, when uh, the, the, the disciples, what would the sign your return? Jesus Christ replied, uh, fourteen verses. And uh, this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached on all the world for witness unto all nations. Then shall, 
and we shall come. Yeah, you know. Jesus spoke this prophecy. Hmm? When Jesus spoke this word, it was a very different world 2,000 years ago. Huh? Communication was limited. The message was carried by, the, uh, by, by food of human beings, uh, by sheep, by uh, the, the horse. That's it. It, it, it took a long time hmm, to, to hold out the people going to send the message, everything, the material, you know, everything at that work, that time. Sometimes uh, the, it's uh, spent a lot of time to get the word out. Uh, you know. No more, that's it. What started, listen, listen, my friend, what started with a movable type printing press in 1439? Mm. Press printing was developed in the 15th centuries. Eventually, it, 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 it butchered into the internet we are using now. Uh, and the smartphone instantly, your fingertip, you, you, you have the world by your hand. Your fingertip control, control this one. Everything you want to do, you want to see, you want to go in smartphone, by smartphone, and you, you're going to send every message, including gospel of Jesus Christ, hallelujah, pray the Lord, give me glory. That we are living, this time we are living right now. You know that. You know more than we are living now. Uh, the last day. Bible told, Bible always foretold, foreshadowed this machine, this internet, smartphone, everything, smart world we are living now. Smartphone, instantly fingertip, your fingertip, your fingertip is doing everything. Uh, access anything, anytime, anywhere. Mm. Listen, today, at uh, about 2.7 billion got the smartphone. Mm. Oh, Matthew 24, 14, I've told you, have never made more sense than in this year. Mm. What that mean? You got the your pocket got the, uh, the, uh, 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 the smartphone that uh, you do everything, uh, whatever you want. It is a potential exist to sending message of Jesus Christ coming to be preached by this phone you have right in your hand. Oh, all right. Ah, I got more than that much time. As the second technology prophecy verse is in the is much discussed between people, you know, uh, Revelation 11, uh, the said about the last evangelist, last two witnesses, last that the two olive, two lamp stand. Bible said, I want to read uh, uh, in the, this chapter 11, Revelation. Uh, that the God gave the power to witness that who is going to preach in the last days. Hmm. You, you are not, you will be not there at that time. We will be called up at that time. It, it, after three and a half year tribulation, yes, I, these times I'm talking to you. Uh, last, last days. The two witnesses. I believe the, uh, Moses Eli and Elijah, because uh, uh, some people Moses and Enoch, but I believe the Moses Elijah, because uh, 
you know, the, 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 the Jesus Christ went to Mount with the disciple and he was transfigured and he was talking to Moses Elijah. That I believe Moses Elijah going to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ in the last days in the tribulation times. The many people are afraid. They don't believe. They are against the Lord God. They rebelled against God, but they preaching the gospel. They got the power. God gave the power the, and the fire to the, the come down from the heaven. Many people are dying. Many people are afraid to witness. But as Satan came out and the key, these two witnesses, the uh, last evangelists, they are three and a half days, one on twenty-sixty day, they were preaching, but they abided and they lay down city of Jerusalem eh? and three and a half days that God gave the breath breath of the life to send this breath of life and they stood up they went resurrect the heaven the people unbelievable wonder surprised going to watch wow wow but my my question is, how this curious point that I want to tell you, curious thing is, is happening. How do people all over the world see the two witness body uh, in Jerusalem? How do they going to watch it? This was impossible in any other age. Previous generation could only guess. Uh, oh, this crazy head. What 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 that? But that's it. Huh? What what this passage describes fits only with the condition. What condition? Huh? This, this generation is going to use this modern technology. You know, I didn't know when I read this passage in Revelation, when I, uh, about the, about I, be, I remember about the four years ago. Yes, yeah, something some like that. I didn't understand how, how could this event is going to happen. Huh? I believe that everybody might be so that same idea that I saw. Huh? How, how, how this will be happen? It's impossible at that time. Hmm? That 40, 40, 50 years ago, 1960, 1970. Huh? This, this, this technology are dawning, dawning, this dawning of this tech, modern technology we are using, a technically connected uh, the smartphone age now, uh, internet in the world. Uh, um, uh, uh, satellite in the universe are doing and effectively and doing <coughs> everything in communication and uh, we are seeing today now uh, it is easy to pick so the message described in Revelation incessantly checking news yeah? or social media website. Social media website we, you are enjoying now by internet, internet network. Update the events 
surrounding these two witness and the this all thing going to happen uh, to turning into the breaking news by CNN, Fox News, other and the broadcasting news going to broadcast this event to witness died on the street of Jesse and people that joy rejoice over the, the two deaths of a witness they stand and give the Bible said and the joy rejoice uh, huh? but peep, the, these two witness caught up by the power of the God and mass media all television net televised they said breaking news the, all people understand what what the miracle has happened what, what's going on we see the superman now that time is coming. Mm -hmm. Oh, hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Here is a, yeah, of course, God could supernaturally use some kind of divine miracle in the sky and God can do everything nothing impossible to the God we don't know what details but God make and let no people that the people the two genes that die but I will say but there is no evidence of this is the revelation account I don't see this how the, this account of revelation in how people knows how people knows understand two witness died on the street and rejected how will they understand uh, details of this account I don't find hmm? but now you understand I understand all believers understand we well, leaving these times because modern technology give us all answer Bible prophecy concerning Concerning modern technology is foretold in the Bible. I have chosen three events that I'm preaching now. Today, just I have told two events Bible prophesied technology that effect to these people in the future hallelujah we see today's technology advancement for shadow for shadow we are seeing today now all right all right then we are really, really living in the last days hallelujah now I don't have much time. One more prophecy. And, and the other thing I want to tell you, the modern technology story that we are very interesting and in our life. And I tell you next week. You don't want to miss. I don't want to. I want you. 
Don't miss this interesting world of that technology we are using now is gives us yes, the brink of the Jesus Christ return second coming. Yeah. We, 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 we see it now. It's, a, it's, a, it's almost Jesus Christ at the door. When we see all things at, are taking place by technology event we are using now. Okay. The miss? I don't. We don't want to miss the next message. Uh, the part B. Uh, in today's technology foretold in Bible prophecy, this is the subject. Don't want to miss it. See you the next week. Bye bye. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Give next, see you next time. Bye bye.